And there are a number of local beekeepers in the Ohio Valley who work hard throughout the year, not just in the summer. News 9's Olivia Zinn sat down with one to find out more. Bees are the prime producers of honey, specifically in the spring and the summer. But what about the winter? We sat down with one local beekeeper to ask just that. Steve and Kathy Roth have been at the forefront of the beekeeping business for the last 27 years. As the owners of Bee Holding Acres, they maintain 18 hives diligently throughout the year. There's even one in their kitchen that was made by an Ohio Valley inmate. We put up uh, a little over 1,000 pounds of honey this past year, about 750 pounds in the springtime, and then another 250 in the fall. And it's become a family affair. It might, might children, my grandchildren, my in-laws, we have a good time with it. We have a lot of fun. While winter may seem like a slow time for bees, Roth actually undergoes a year-round process in order for the bees to prosper in the spring. So I have taken measures through the summer to, to, to combat the mites, to make sure that my bees go into the winter healthy, disease-free, um, adequate stores and adequate numbers. If a beekeeper follows that routine, the colony will survive. But if they fall short, the colony could experience some turmoil into next season. Honeybees will also find their own ways to push through the better temperatures. Roth says that each hive will store up to 90 pounds of honey to keep warm. When I make sure that they're set for the winter, they have adequate stores to get through the winter, then I'm done. I'm done then again until spring when, when they start to, to multiply again and the, the flowers come into bloom. If you're interested in learning more about the art of beekeeping, there are introductory classes to be held this February and March at the Ogilvy Good Zoo. We'll have more information on our website, WTOV9.com. For now reporting in the Wheeling Content Center, I'm Olivia Zinn for News 9. Hi, I'm Jamie Baker. Thanks for watching. Here's another video for you to watch, and please be sure to subscribe to our channel.